Hello YouTube. Today we are trying out the new Dart screen fitted to the Bobber Black and including uh, VAT and postage. I think it came out at about £116. And it's a really nice quality screen. All the brackets and everything are really good. So it fits really well. Very easy to fit. All you need is a 5mm Allen key. Here we have the uh, installation of the Dart screen. As you can see, it's quite easy. It's just got a clamp here with a bracket. All you need is a 5mm Allen key to tighten these two and then there's a little fixing behind here oh and then a 4mm allen key for the screen screws it's very easy to install just got this clamp here clamps together little bracket screws on there and then you screw your screen on there and it's made by dart they do all kinds of screens in fact they do a screen for the scrambler we've got the standard screen on the scrambler but the uh, dart one comes up about that much and I must admit I'm very tempted because this one the reason why I brought this one was to hide all the nonsense behind the clock but it doesn't actually do a lot when you're sort of sitting bolt upright sort of speeds over about 65 70 um, you could do with something probably up to about there just to take it take the wind off of you makes it a bit more relaxing when you're on a long motorway ride so we might look at a dark one especially if they do a tinted one uh, to go in place of this so that'd be something to look at in the future but going back to the bobber yes I think I think it looks quite good with this uh, screen on so we'll go out for a ride and uh, see how we get on I don't think it looks too bad from the uh, riding position. And we've also, while we've been doing this, we've put these uh, put these Triumph mirrors on it. I got these. I had these on my Thruxton. I'm not a hundred percent sold on them. The problem with them is they're really small, and you don't get to see a lot out of them when you're sort of riding. So. I'm going to give them a go today, but I'll probably end up putting the standard mirrors back on it. I just, uh, I just remember with the Thruxton, I ended up, I ended up buying a pair of uh, Speed Triple mirrors for that, which are a bit smaller than the big round ones, but they just look nicer. So uh, yeah, we'll give these a go, and uh, and see how we get on. And also, you need them in this position rather than that position because it makes the bars another a couple of inches wider which uh, is a bit of a pain when you're filtering or trying to get it out of uh, a tight spot so uh, yeah we'll see how we get on with those what we'll do is we'll go on to a dual carriageway now and uh, get some speed up actually moved the seat forward on this which is really easy it's just a 17 mil spanner two nuts to undo and then uh, you can move the seat backwards and forwards and I've moved it right forwards and uh, actually it's a much nicer riding position I think there's a little bit of difference uh, doing about 75 now doesn't seem to be uh, pushing you off the seat quite as much although there may be a little bit more wind noise um, but it is quite windy today so it's hard to tell we're doing about 75 80 now I don't feel like I'm being pushed off the 
bike quite as much as normally. I'll tell you what though, this uh, moving the seat forward made quite a difference. I've got the screen fitted fairly low down towards the headlamp. And uh, be, you could move it up quite a bit. Well, say quite a bit, you probably move it up about another 20 mil if you wanted. So I think there is, there is a noticeable difference, but I think you do get a little bit more wind noise. I may take it off and ride it without, because I never really pay much attention to the wind noise, but uh, there may just be a little bit more wind noise with this on. But it's definitely a nice quality product. It's, it's, you know, when you look at the uh, thickness of the mountain brackets, they're definitely thicker than the Triumph ones you get on the Triumph Scrambler, definitely. The only thing is, uh, where's the Triumph Scrambler one? That actually uh, bolts to the headlamp brackets. On this one you do have a little clamp. Yeah, so with this screen, I think it will also fit the Triumph Speedmaster. They, uh, they make two different clamp sizes, the one for the standard bobber, and then the bobber black, which has got the uh, wider bolt stanchion. So, yeah, that will also uh, work with the Speedmaster. So it definitely gives you a little bit of protection. It's not a lot, but it's, uh, there's a difference. So, uh, yeah, thanks for watching, and uh, we'll be back again soon.